It's Friday, July 18th, 2014. Hello, I'm Veronique Masterson. Here's what you need to know about what's happening at the University of Texas at El Paso. Undergraduate research at UTEP has been around for more than 40 years and continues to trend upward because of its ability to increase student interest, engagement, and participation in all disciplines, but particularly in the sciences and engineering. Currently, about 150 undergraduate students, many from foreign countries, are enhancing their research skills as part of several UTEP summer programs. The students, almost all majoring in science, technology, engineering, and mathematics, have been working with UTEP faculty mentors on topics like homeland security, materials for solar cells, the biodiversity of the Chihuahuan Desert, applied intelligence systems, and methods in the neuroscience of drug abuse. The junior researchers will present their work in a symposium August 2nd. The five UT system institutions that make up the initiative A Primetime were on campus for the first time this week for their summer conference. The institutions involved are UT Brownsville, UT Pan Am, UT Medical Branch Galveston, UT Medical School Houston, and UTEP. The mission of the initiative is to create pathways for the best students from West Texas and the Rio Grande Valley to earn their bachelor's degrees and complete medical school in a total of six years. UTEP and NMSU have teamed up to improve the quality of life for those living in West Texas and Southern New Mexico colonias. UTEP researchers and students are reviewing the existence of water contaminants and determining the most affordable and manageable over-the-counter system to use. NMSU health psychologists are working with residents to study their level of confidence in the system and drinking the water it produces. The goal is to provide residents a steady supply of drinkable water so they can redirect the money spent on bottled water. This summer, UTEP social work students are putting their learning into practice by volunteering or interning at community agencies in El Paso, including the Clint ISD Homeless Program, El Paso Psychiatric Center, and the Boys and Girls Club. Several undergraduate and graduate students from the College of Health Sciences Social Work Program are volunteering at the Annunciation House, a homeless shelter in downtown El Paso. There, they assist hundreds of migrants from Central America to connect with family members across the United States. Students have relied on the organization, engagement, and assessment skills they learned in class to properly engage families and make them feel safe. Since July, the students have assisted 330 families. For more information about these and other stories, check out utepnews.com. I'm Veronique Masterson. We'll see you next Friday. Go Miners!